Hey guys, welcome back to another Tech Guru video. Today we're in Adobe InDesign CC and I'm going to be showing you a quick tutorial on how to create QR codes within Adobe InDesign CC. So you may be asking yourself, what is a QR code? It stands for Quick Response. You may have seen these on pamphlets or flyers that you have been given. You may see them on products. You may see them on a number of things, but what it allows you to do is scan a QR code with your cellular device, whether it be your iPhone or Android device or your tablet, whatever has an app that can scan a QR code and it'll take you to a website. It'll send a text message to you. It will do some type of thing when you scan the QR code. So let's go ahead and let me show you how to create a QR code within Adobe InDesign. CC. So the first thing you need to do is go ahead and have your link or phone number or whatever you want it to do when you have that QR code scanned by somebody that's using your product. Once we've done that and we have the link here, which is this is a link to my YouTube channel. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and select that text. So I'm going to go ahead and select it and then I'm going to copy that text. So I'm going to go up here to edit and then go to copy just like that. And the next thing I want to do is go ahead and create a frame. So I already have a square frame drawn out here in the center of the document. If you do not have one, go on over to the frame tool, which is right here, and you can make it uh, circular, rectangular, polygonal, however you want to do it. You can do any type of shape for the frames, but in order to create a QR code, you have to have a frame to insert it into. So once we have that frame selected with our selection tool, we're then going to go up up to object and then down to generate QR code or you can just right click on that and then go down to generate QR code they both do the same thing once we've done that we're going to be prompted to this screen here that says generate QR code now the one that we're going to want to go to specifically is under this type drop down menu here we're going to select web hyperlink this is going to take whoever scans that code right to my YouTube channel or my URL that I enter here in this box you have a number of options though you can do just plain text you can do a text message it'll text message those people you just put in the phone number you want it to come from or go to the message and it'll do it there you can also do email and business card so let's go back up to web hyperlink and I have the URL here already in the option and I can even change the color of the QR code if I wanted to but I'm not going to do that once I have the link into the QR code generator I'm then going to go down to the OK button and click OK and I now have a nice weird looking QR code on my document this is great if you're putting out flyers or templates and you're wanting people to sign up for a race like a 5k race or whatever it may be they can scan this code it'll take them directly to your website to sign up right to the sign up page and it's convenient and it really makes you look like you know what you're doing so if you have any questions about QR codes or how to create them in Adobe InDesign CC go ahead and put those in the comment box below don't forget to follow me uh, on Twitter subscribe to my YouTube channel like this video down below and I will see you guys next time Thank <laughs> you.